Hi, I hope you're having an amazing day. As you saw from the title of this video, today we're going to be doing a City Color Cosmetics Roundup. Basically, basically, basically I got everything that I own from City Color in my collection. New products, old products, everything. I do have some of them on my face today. And we're going to talk about them and give a little bit of speed reviews on everything. So if you like that type of video, of course, keep on watching and we're going to get into it. I'll tell you guys, things that I haven't touched, things that I have, that I love, things that I hate. So if you want to see what those products are, of course what if you want to see what those products are of course just keep on watching before that don't forget if you like drugs and makeup go ahead and stick around subscribe maybe hit the bell so notify whenever i upload and if you can like the video if you like it and the video is going to start right now so i have quite a bit of products next to me it's kind of crazy i almost postponed this video to film it another day because it's just like so much makeup but again we're just going to do rapid reviews i have my basket here that we're going to fill up with products as I go. Let's get the one that I never really use out of the way that they actually sent my way, which is really sweet of them. I love, I'm receiving PR from City Color, any brand, you know, it's always appreciated when they want to send products my way. But I got this product in the mail and this is a CBD lip scrub. It's just not one that I ever used. I think I like tried it once, but there's not like a lot of thoughts on this product. So let me know if you've tried it it's just kind of there you get a lot of product in this component so it looks really nice however i haven't really been into the lip scrub train it's just like not something that i reach for all the time so that's kind of just there i literally forgot i have the lip oil in my bag so we went to Disneyland and I took the lip oil with me because it is such an amazing formula. I'm so sad that I don't have it here with me. I'll have a picture on the screen, but oh my god. I just purchased it. It is a new and improved tube. Sucks that I forgot it in my purse, but I'm not going to get up and get it. But it's amazing. So I have a picture on the screen. Super affordable. If you love lip oils, you're going to love that. So that sucks. But All right, let's get into brow products. So I think... Oh, I have this too. So the City Color Be Bold Brow Soap. I used to rave about so much. If you're into the brow soap trend, you're definitely going to enjoy this. You get like a big tub of this situation. You don't have to wet it. It's already kind of like a jelly type of substance. And it works so well. Keeps your brows in place. And it just looks amazing. They look super spiky. So if you're into that, you're really much going to enjoy it. However, I haven't really been into this product because I am so in love with their Be Bold brow gel and it's just a clear brow gel i have it on the brows today it is so amazing it just keeps my brows in place this is the product that i reach for when i'm going to be traveling when i'm going to be you know when i need my makeup to last all day i need my brows not to move and stay in place for work whatever it may be this is what i reach for so i really much enjoy this and this is the second tube that i purchased from these and they resell for two dollars so they're like super inexpensive so love this and then we have their brow pencil so i have two colors i have the shade dark brown which i really much enjoy and i also have the shade espresso so dark brown is brown okay so it looks brown on the eyebrow so i don't really reach for that one as much and then we have the shade espresso which i use in i forgot to mention this but i did do a full face of city color cosmetics so that's going to be down below on the screen everywhere i did that i also did a city color haul on a real on instagram so definitely check that out if you haven't already so i'm going to be talking about a couple of the products from that haul but some of them i haven't used on the face yet so they're still progressing or whatever so they're not in this haul but or in this video but this is amazing i tried this out in that full face of city color cosmetics video and i really much enjoyed it i mentioned it in a favorites video for the month of july i really much enjoy this product it's really good it's not going to smear everywhere it's a really good formula so if you're into micro brow pencils you're really much going to enjoy those these are their city color canvas base situation so they have so many colors they just came out with some darker shades they actually sent these my way i just really haven't been into these kind of products but if you love cutting your crease and you want a concealer kind of base that's colored kind of like the p louise situation you're really much gonna enjoy these they come in so many colors i know a lot of brands came out with them beauty creations have a whole line of these as well so just know that city color has them for a much affordable price so they come in so many colors so they have the shade ladylike i did swatch all of these on my instagram a long time ago we have the shade carousel which is a beautiful yellow we have the shade amethyst which is a more purpley pink we have the shade minty which looks so beautiful actually i'm gonna reach for that soon then we have the shade wisteria which is a white 
kind of shade and then we have the shade sky and again they came out with a bunch of dark shades so like these but in a dark shade so they came out with black they came out with a dark purple dark green all type of colors so if you're into these type of color based primers you're really much going to enjoy now these products i don't reach for but again if you're into them you're really going to enjoy them they're an amazing formula i swatched all of them on my instagram they actually sent these my way these are their aqua fx liners so if you're into these kind of cake liners that you have to wet and activate you're really much going to enjoy these these are super neon look at this color so beautiful this one's in the shade electric we have the shade echo and i did again swatch these on my instagram so head over there if you want to see that and these are this one is in azure and then we have this pink which is in the shade neon love these are so stunning again if you're into that neon kind of liner moment if you love doing dramatic kind of looks you're really really gonna love these and they're just stunning especially for the summer next we have these products so these are also a newer product that they just came out with and this is a dual product it comes with a shimmer situation like a shimmer shadow as well as a matte shadow on the other side this is called their liquid pigments be bold liquid pigments we have all the shades here i tried using these on my instagram on reels so i do have some videos on these i've also i think i also use them on a youtube video as well this is the shade rich girl it's so beautiful if you want swatches they're always watching them on their instagram city color cosmetics also on tiktok um this one here is an envy so beautiful to be honest i'm not really into this type of trend especially with the matte shade i really much enjoy the um kind of shimmery shade more but the matte shade i'm kind of like mm, i'm still trying to get a hang of these type of products this one here is in the in the shade iris which is purple and so if you're into them definitely check them out this one here is in crimson which is more red and then we have this beautiful neon blue in la disco i also have this product which i never really use this is their fairy lights liquid glitter eyeshadow they, it comes in like a couple other shades i just don't really touch it so i don't really have any like firm thoughts on this product i'm just kind of like eh. but it is a glittery shadow with a kind of like a wet texture but that's what it is but it, i just don't really touch it then we also have this product which is a staple in my collection i always have to purchase this this is called their sparkle and shine eye primer no glitter primer so i just use this to apply my loose glitters and it works so great so if you're into loose glitters and you need a glitter glue or whatever i just use this to like kind of throw it on as an applicator and it works so well so i really much enjoy that these liners i did use one today i don't think i brought it with me it's like next to me but it's a mess kind of um but i do have the white one on over top of my eyeliner today this one here is one that i used recently in a video and this is called their be bold color liner i did pick up every single pastel shade that they have also their deeper tones recently in a haul again it's on my instagram and these are just amazing and they just stand out so much and i feel like the white just kind of made this look it's just so beautiful i, I could have even just used this one so pigmented stunning let's talk about mascara so i do have two mascaras from them i did finish up the pink tube already i mentioned it in a um, recent empties video so i do have their city color be baddie mascara and this is actually my favorite out of the two that i'm going to be mentioning i really much enjoy the packaging it's so cute but also the wand the formula i really love this one so this one i feel like actually does something to the lashes it gives you volume it gives you length it's so beautiful i love it the be bold mascara so this one actually came out with their um, liners and they usually come out with like little collections so i don't know this one just kind of everything rubbed off so i kind of forgot that this is city color the wand is okay as you can see it's very different from our last wand but something about this formula it doesn't really do anything for my lashes i much rather this one here i forgot to mention the lip plumper so i actually tried this out in I don't know what video it was it was like a trying to make a video or something i tried this out and honestly i don't really remember my thoughts on it so i'm not gonna really say much on it but i remember it giving me like a little tingling maybe i don't know i'll have to try it out again but i don't remember much about this now that we're here let's talk about their eyelashes love them both if you're into lashes you want to try them out they're not as easy to throw on as like let's say ioni lashes that i have on today but the styles are amazing and it's like once i got in the pair so i purchased the style maria and these are stunning i i 
mentioned them in so many favorites videos they're just like an amazing style they're super spiky and stunning and then i purchased some in the style steph which to try it out in my full face of city color cosmetics they're just an amazing line and they have so many other styles to choose from they're a great quality lash so if you're into lashes check them out the be bold cut liner i did purchase the brown one i haven't gotten a chance to use it but the black one is amazing i mentioned it in a recent favorite video for the month of june no not june for the month of july it's just an amazing formula it's almost like dry but it's really easy to use and you i feel because of the dry texture of the liner it helps you make less mistakes so it's like goof proof in my opinion and it's just so easy to use so if you're a beginner aligner i think you're really much gonna enjoy that and it's really black as well so i really like that i do have these two primers underneath my foundation today i have the city color glowing complexion illuminating cream this was so nice i really much enjoyed it definitely gave me a glow to the skin and then we have this product which was really surprising and again these were first impressions so i haven't really used them past today but this one here their clear canvas primer it's meant to hydrate smooth brighten and firm honestly it's like very liquidy it's like you're throwing water on your skin which is really weird i thought it was going to be more just a thicker formula but it really does come out like water so that was interesting i definitely have to keep trying it out to gather more thoughts on this then we have the foundation that i'm wearing today which is the city color b matte foundation these are amazing super full coverage i think i also mentioned this in my favorites video for july and as you can see i have it on the skin today it's so full coverage it's amazing especially if you're going to be um, out for a long time or if you need something for a party or like in quinceanera or something you need something to look full coverage and flawless definitely pick this foundation up so if you have oily skin i think you're really much gonna enjoy this because it is pretty it is a matte foundation so you're not gonna look super shiny but oh my god it's so beautiful and i did throw on the shade matte 202 i think this just matches me so well i also have the shade 201 which is just a little too light but oh, i'm telling you this is such an amazing foundation next we have their concealer which is interesting i don't see it on their website anymore but this is their full coverage flawless concealer i have the shade medium two and it's just a little too light for me so if i could go back i would purchase it a shade deeper a shade down but yeah it's just kind of there you know it's full coverage it's a really nice concealer is it a favorite mm, i think it's okay if you're looking for a concealer but again it's not on their website anymore which kind of sucks next we have a lip gloss i also purchased a lip liner and a liquid lipstick from their website which i haven't gotten a chance to use so we'll definitely have to do another full face of city color cosmetics so i'm going to show you guys the eyeshadows that i have from their website i have a lot of eyeshadow palettes so let me know in the comments which palette you guys want me to use in that next video which would be really helpful just so i know you know next time but i also have their gloss this is so beautiful it is like a glittery kind of lip gloss and this is their swirly pop lip gloss definitely recommend if you like like lip glosses it smells really good it smells like candy amazing let's talk about their complexion products i have i don't have their face palette here there's so many products that i kind of put back that i forgot about but i also have their face palette which comes with with the heart kind of packaging it's really cute definitely 10 out of 10 recommend that i also have some of their single products i have their gummy glow i use in my full face of city color cosmetics such a beautiful formula it's kind of that putty kind of texture feels really nice and it just works so well so this one here is in the shade pineapple bear then we have their blush which actually broke on me so there's a little piece missing but this is their keep blooming baked blush in the shade chocolate cosmo stunning we have their city color be matte bronzer another product that's amazing this one here is in the shade pecan pie and it did break on me so i did repress it but uh, such an amazing amazing color for me i have their contour effects palette which is stunning this is the one that i use in my full face of city color cosmetics it's so beautiful as you can see this is my favorite shade in the middle so good so if you're into contouring definitely check this out and also tells you like where to put everything as well let's quickly go through the eyeshadows eyeshadows are 10 out of 10 they're a little powdery but what palette isn't i have a bunch of these little palettes that are part of their paradise love collection this one here is in hashtag purple vibes so stunning now a lot of these palettes come with a glitter in the center and i also did a look with each and every one of them on my instagram so i also have this one in green vibes the letters are kind of rubbing off but there's a look at that then we have the one in hashtag orange vibes which is so stunning and uh, so beautiful there's a look at that again it comes with a glitter 
and then we have the last one in hashtag pink vibes again so stunning and again i have looks with all of these looks and videos and everything on my instagram this is one that unfortunately i haven't gotten a chance to use on camera and i never really use it off camera either this is their city color whimsical forest palette it's so beautiful however i don't think this is available on their website anymore how stunning is this packaging you kind of open it up like that and this is the color story this is one that i use in a i believe i did another full face of city color cosmetics a couple years ago and this is a palette that i use la sandia palette they also have la piña palette which i'm really tempted to pick up but there's the color story of this so stunning and lastly we have their newer palette and this is their 90s whatever forever palette so stunning again i mentioned this in my favorites video this is basically a rainbow palette it's such a great formula so affordable so amazing made it to the end i hope you enjoyed watching as much as i did from this feed today everything that i talked about the names of the prices is going to be down below as well as any videos that I mentioned throughout this video or videos that opened last week don't forget to upload three times a week on tuesday thursday and sunday so if you can stick around it would be amazing i have my insta handle displayed on the screen i post a lot of makeup finds on drugs for the high end so if that interests you go ahead and follow me there and it'd be so amazing if you could like and subscribe of course you don't have to get your own personally make your own decisions but it wouldn't hurt to give this video a like and i'll see you guys in the next one bye